This is Gabriel Gonzalez for Cage Side Press here with Spike Carlisle who takes on AJ McKee at Bellator 286 in Long Beach this Saturday. Uh, Spike, I mean, first off, man, I need you to spill the beans. Yeah. You're in SoCal, you're in your part of the world. What are you planning for your walkout when that music hits in Long Beach? Can't spill the beans. You guys what you mean? Cut. Can't spill the beans, man. No, it's going to be fun, though. Uh, it's going to be... Uh, electrifying to say the least. Low key, have you, like, do you have some special plan? Because you've gone big for some regional shows. Yeah. I can only imagine, yeah. do you have something like, you know, and no, we really got it. We got a classic, classic coming up, and uh, we'll just drop a, a quick hint maybe. I'm a real American. <laughs> I'm ready for it. I'm ready. Um, a lot of people talking about, hey, you're like in as close to AJ McKee's literal backyard as one can get, but you're a SoCal guy yourself. Just what do you expect in terms of fan support for you when yeah. you guys get out there on Saturday? Yeah, definitely. Uh, born and raised in San Diego. I live in Orange County now, so it's going to be, uh, I'm sure I'll have quite a few people there. I know he's from Long Beach. This is his uh, hometown, obviously, so he'll probably have the whole crowd behind him, but uh, I'm, it's going to be a quiet night after we're done. Can we talk a little bit about your contract? Because obviously, you know, you've been, let's be honest, you fought for just about everybody now. Cage Warriors, you made it to Ryzen, which I know is a big dream. Yeah. And now back to Bellator, are you on like a multi-fight deal or was this a, hey, Spike, we have a great relationship with you. Do you want this one with AJ? Yeah. No, I have a uh, multi-contract with Bellator. What's so cool about Bellator is they give fighters the options and freedoms. You just saw uh, Michael Venom Page fight Bare Knuckle, which was super cool. And uh, they allowed me to go and compete in Ryzen in Japan, which has been a lifelong dream. So uh, grateful for Bellator for allowing us to do this. It's amazing. Now, talking about AJ, moving up to 55, we obviously have a ton of tape on him at 45. Are you expecting something necessarily, you know, noticeably different about him moving up in weight for his first one? Uh, no, to be honest, I think uh, it's going to be very similar to his last fight. His last fight was in April. Uh, physically, he cannot really change his body too much. It's, it's only six months, so I don't think he's going to be uh, very, very much different, to be honest. So, no. And then my final question, you have a really dynamic kid out there in his style. Just what, without obviously giving away, you know, the game plan, what are some of the things in terms of neutralizing a guy who does a lot of those unorthodox things like he does? Unorthodox. I, I'm the wild card. I'm the wild man. So I, yeah, I think he's going to be the one having to uh, kind of go with his eyes wide open. So uh, it's a terrible style matchup for him. Spike, we always know you bring it. We always know it's a great one. We're looking forward to another one on Saturday. Thanks Thank for the time. You.